make you young. Good morning, or whatever time it is. It's that o'clock. It's that o'clock here. Ridiculous o'clock. But, but, here's the thing. I'm a bit, look at the hold up a lot. The thing I want to say to you is, yeah, today I'm going on a really, really cool road trip. Going away for a couple of days to do a talk with Jackie. On Ackle Island. Oh, I'm 43 years on this planet. I've never even seen Ackle Island. So I can't wait. I'm so excited and I'd love to bring you with me. I'm going to try and do this. So Jackie's coming to collect me in a while. I'm looking at the monitor here. I clearly need to have a wash and get dressed. You could probably smell me through the feckin' screen, can you? But uh, yeah, come with me as we, we head to Ackle Island to give a talk. I'm super excited, but you know what? I need to get changed, folks, don't they? Yup. A little bit more respect, what is it? Yeah, actually, big shout out to the Break Trail Project, to the ninjas from Ringsdown College. I'll be coming to see you guys really, really soon. As soon as Jackie Fox stops working me to the bone. But yeah, I'll be coming to see you guys soon. So I hope you have something ready for me. I hope you have something ready for me. So I'm just waiting for Jackie to get here. She's never late, so actually, she's gonna be here any minute. And I just wanted to take a second because I'm super nervous. So I've never done this. I've signed up to do vlogs and I've never done this. I've never gone on the road and brought me camera and tried to show you a day. But I think it's really, really exciting what's happening with me and Jackie. We're heading to Ackle Island to do a talk on the island. And then we're traveling to Mayo and doing a talk there. But I just really, really hope I get it right. I have some of the ideas in my head. I hope the music's good. I hope you enjoy the B-roll. I hope you enjoy what I can show you of the talks. Yeah, I hope you enjoy it because at the end of the day, Everything I do, I do it for you. What a dickhead. So Jackie's gonna be here soon, but you don't have to wait. I do, you don't. Cause she's gonna be here now. Let me see who I've got here. Look who we have here. Open the door. Holy jug it is. Look who it is. <laughs> Jackie Fox, ladies and gentlemen. Jackie Fox, Jackie, you excited? I am. Are you excited, I'm Jackie? Excited. Are you ready to <laughs> go? Let's do this, Jackie. Let's do this, girl. So, um, so, so the radio never works, huh? No. Oh, oh look, a, a, another sign saying we're fucking miles away. So there we are, tipping away, wherever we are. Where are we now, Jackie? Yeah, it's not quite nasty, Jackie. <laughs> Jackie just relies on the old Google Maps like us all. And my good friend Diane from the stall is after hitting me up there. And she asked me to do this <laughs> so long ago. I'm so sorry, I'm so feckin' sorry. But I wanna give a shout out to Diane, and I wanna just give a quick mention about Diane's company, which is Light Bikes. It's also lightbikes.ie. Here's the, uh, here's the website here. Um, it's an amazing thing to, to, to maybe think about doing this summer. Head on down to Kerry, head hit up Diane, get a couple of bikes off her, and let Diane uh, do the rest. But look, if you, if it's something that you're into, guys, please, the link is below. Have a look, give Diane some love. Um, and yeah, it could be a really cool thing to do with your family, your friends this uh, this summer, especially if the weather's like this. Could be really cool. Do you want to go on a bike ride with me? <laughs> like, it's not mastermind, you know? Jackie Vox has just had to hit me up with something that I didn't know. Hitting me up. Hi, I'm 14. Let's try that again. Snap. Jackie's just had to hit me up. <laughs> <laughs> Jackie's just had to tell me it's a year today, Jackie, since Coco Law was passed. A year today. That's just unbelievable. I don't know where that year is at the moment. That's so amazing. amazing. I'm sorry that the audio is bad in these videos, by the way, because I haven't got the mic. Sorry. But yeah, but what Jackie's saying there, <laughs> it's a year today since Coco Law has passed. That's that is absolutely amazing. Quite fitting that we're. We're heading off to tell people that live on Ackle Island all about it. Well, I think what Jackie's done in that year is just, I, I, I've been inc incredibly privileged to be a part of it. I think anyone watching this, maybe maybe just put a big love heart in the comments somewhere for uh, for Nicole, first and foremost, but uh, but for Jackie as well. A year today, Coco's Law's in. I know, it's just, uh, I don't know where that time went, and we've done so much in between that year. It's just, everything's meant. So you're checking herself out in the mirror then. See the way she looks at herself then. If you had two pairs of lips, you'd kiss yourself. <laughs> Look at that.
Jackie was talking about, she got sent a couple of jokes not long after Nicole died and she didn't get them. Like she didn't find them funny at all. And I just happened to say that I think she lived in a complete haze for at least two years. I suppose that's what I just like to ask you that Jackie, like you probably just just existed for the first couple of years, did you? I did exist and and to be honest, if it wasn't for you, I would be still back in January 2018 because I wouldn't have had a clue how to move forward. I would have been still existing, not having not having a clue. And it was only with the hard kick in the in the arse that you gave me, especially over the last year, I'd be still existing now and still not getting jokes or still not being able to, to, to process things. I, I think, yeah. thanks for saying that right, you're a fucker, if I meant to say that. Hey, look, you chose yeah. life, Jackie. I think that was the, the, the big game changer for me because I, I always remember you saying to me, you know, what would make you happy? And I said, just some kind of normal, any kind of normal. I wasn't asking to be doing cartwheels or anything like that over a year, but I, just some kind of normal. That's all I, I asked for, but, you know, since what you walking with me over here. I've got more than some kind of normal. I, I forgot how to smile. I forgot how to laugh. I, I, I just literally existed. But now, you know, it is. I know it's okay to laugh. We have laughs in the car all the time. Doesn't mean I forget Nicole for a single second. I don't. But I know it's okay to, to laugh. We have great laughs in the car. Um, it's okay to laugh. It's okay I'm not laughing, life. don't fucking bother crying now. <laughs> I chose life and um, I needed the tools and you showed me the tools. Yeah, I put in the work, but I needed the tools to put in the work. I just think this is a very refreshing conversation for the simple reason that a lot of students, obviously students are our, our main audience, they're our only audience. I think there's a, a Jackie in our talk, it takes a, about a minute in our talk. And she says to them, please listen to the end of what I'm about to say. And she says a child's life. She says what she says, but then she says a child's life. It gets a lot more child every time, but I think that's so important. Especially with everything Jackie's been through. Um, sorry that this got very serious. Is that a crash in front of us? Shit. Uh, wow, he's getting pulled out. Thanks for sharing that with us though. I'm personally so thankful that you chose life very very strong message to send out there that the trauma you've been through and your family has been through and I know you had your doubt but you chose life we're all fucking delighted just out here now drive the bleeding car will you Just arrived on Ackle Island. Jackie's having a oh, conniption yeah. there. Look. Here we are in Ackle. Very exciting. So we arrived in the hotel, and as you can see behind me, Jackie's talking to honestly, nicest lady. Uh, can I interrupt you two lovely ladies? This is Mary, folks. This is Mary, and Mary should be the ambassador for Ackle Island. She is currently mapping out our day for us. We're here four minutes and we've had the nicest welcome ever. I just got into Jackie's room and look at her, look at her. Look at the view she has. Look how beautiful this island is. Do you like your room, Jacqueline? Lovely, yeah. No, I haven't seen my room yet. We're going to have a look. I'm hoping it's the same. And you're going to have to look at, she's at the fucking window again. Look. YouTube, will you decide? Who got the better room? I'm starting, I'm kind of thinking this Jackie got the better room. Will I answer? Hello? Hey, Mary. Oh, Mary, you are an absolute star. Mary, you're just telling me that there's a beautiful red sky outside. If I want to catch it, that's exactly what I'm going to do, Mary. Thank you. Bye-bye. 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 The sun sets over there. Yeah, look at the view. It's beautiful. Look at the How's it going? So I just uh, had to knock on Jackie's door there. She's holding the camera. Hey, say hello, Jackie. Hello. So I was up in my room. I said goodnight and I get a message. And it, it doesn't matter who the message was from. I don't want to say the person's name. I came up and I, 
I read it out to Jackie and Jackie said I should read it out in this. Just for a bit of context, I think this is why me and Jackie do what we do. This, this is this. Hi, I don't know if you read your messages on here, but I just wanted to say a huge thank you. You gave a talk on my son's school yesterday. He has been struggling on and off with his mental health for some months now. I've never heard him so positive or enthusiastic after school, lol. He told me all about the talk and that he had a quiet word with you after. I've just ordered your book, I have enough for him yesterday. I have a wonderful, wonderful relationship with my son and encourage talking about everything and feelings, good or bad. And he does openly chat about his issues. And I believe you spoke about this. So I just wanted to say a massive, massive thank you for storing the passion in him and letting him see that men can talk. I'll never forget the passion and empathy that was portrayed from my son from your session with him and his classmates. Thank you so much and keep up your fantastic work. Um, like, I don't even know why I'm doing this on the, this vlog, but you know, I'm hoping you might see some of our when Jackie's talks tomorrow. There's not a lot I can film. But Jackie, you get, you get a lot of messages like that too, don't you? Yeah, I get so many messages from students and from parents. It's the parents that reach out to say how much the talk has affected their, the students that we talk to in such a positive way. But to get the messages from students is absolutely fantastic. Tons of messages. Yeah, getting them from the parents as well is absolutely fantastic. We know, that's when we know we're doing the perfect job. Mm. So there you go. That's just that bit of the blog. See you tomorrow for the talk. Bit emotional now. Nothing of this.